All right, Texas A&M and Ole Miss. Again, in this SEC, we've got uh, Ole Miss three-point home favorites, 53.5 the total uh, in this game. Uh, money coming in on A&M, I agree. Uh, I certainly think at three and a half, four, where this line opened, I was definitely a buyer on A&M. Uh, I like their defense. I like the way, I like the way even with the uh, unfortunate injury, of course, uh, suffered by a uh, Wegman who I really liked at quarterback. You know, he's, he's good enough to get the job done. Max Johnson, you know, Max Johnson comes from LSU. He was there before uh, at that program. Uh, he's a veteran quarterback. He's experienced. Uh, they can still rely on their run game, the defense as well. Um, I agree with this number coming down where it opened Old Miss minus four. It's down to three. There's still some three and a half. DraftKings has three and a half still with Texas A&M. I kind of like that side a little bit here uh, in this game. I know Old Miss, we, we like their offense a little bit. I still have some questions about their uh, defense. Uh, Jackson Dart has probably had a better season so far this year. They are 5-0 and at home, so they've played good football here at, on, in their home uh, venue. But, you know, you look at the LSU game, survived it barely uh, in a shootout. Arkansas, you know, 27-20 uh, at home as well. Um, you know, th those were their two best probably opponents at home. We'll see how they fare here in this one. I'm, I'm leaning a little bit here to the A&M side uh, in this one. Uh, as far as the size, the total I'm neutral on. I think it could go either way. What do you think here, Connor? Yeah, you know, I, you know, they give up some, but I think Ole Miss's defense has been pretty good for most of the year. I know they got the shootout with LSU and a and I think still has the better defense. But let's see it on the road here with Johnson. I, I get why you liked it. Just four and a half, four, three and a half. But if this goes down a little bit, I lean Ole Miss. I, I want them at home. I think they can get the job done. I just don't uh, trust this A&M team away from the house. 